I'll come here right. to fly. They love coming in here, and then they love dying in the window. All right, ready when you are. Okay. Uh, these are are uh, English. Some of, most of them are English. Some of them were made by the Confederacy. I just recently picked this one up. It's made by the Confederates because it's so crude. But what these were were fired from a Whitworth rifle. The Whitworth rifle was a six-sided inside rifle. The, the rifling inside was six-sided. So when the bullet is put in, the bullet is the same shape, six-sided. So when it's fired, it can't but help stay in the rifling. And it would get tremendous range. It was a sharpshooter rifle and mostly used by the Confederacy. They came in two major varieties, the smooth ones and those that have the six sides. Uh, some argue that the six-sided ones were not used during the American Civil War, only the, the cylindrical or the smooth ones, but that has been proved wrong because here's one from Gettysburg. From the first day's battle, that's six-sided. So they did indeed use them during the Civil War. Uh, so these are just different varieties. Uh, there's one here. Where'd you go? Here. This guy here, it's a fired one. I found this uh, on the Bloody Lane in Antietam uh, way back in the late 70s. Late 70s, I found that. I had that checked by a, one of the guys who knows a lot about bullets, and he says, yep, it's a fired Whitworth. That's what it is. So these are Whitworth bullets, cylindricals, and hexagonals. Some use a paper patch. And by the way, stay there for just a minute. This is a photograph out of a published book. This is here. These bullets I purchased from, that they're the ones that are right here, and these are the ones that are right here. These are the ones that are photographed. So these are published, and we know what they are, and basically where they were found, so we know they're Civil War. And that will just about do it. Oh, there were some fake ones put out. Uh, there was... Uh, Bullets like this that look very, very similar to that. Very similar, except that they're not. These are Sharps rifles that they used after the Civil War to shoot buffalo. These are the Sharps bullets that were used. 40, 44, 45 caliber, and uh, that's what these are. They're the smaller Sharps. The difference is this has a dished base. The Civil War ones have a cone base. So that's what gives that away. They're cones. The Civil War ones are cones. And the post-Civil War sharps, as you can see, still have just a dished base. And that, unfortunately, is how I learned the difference after I bought these things. So you win some, you lose some. Um, these are the cartridges that these Whitworths would have came in. And these are a bunch of uh, shot ones that... I picked up at different shows, and one of them I already mentioned I had found. And some of them you can see the, the six-sided on it, and some of them you can't. They're just smooth. They just miss the rifling, I suppose. Here you can see the rifling on that one, the six sides, as some of the other ones. You wonder who they were shooting at, because these shots, when these were, these were deliberately aimed shots, they had a target in mind when they pulled the trigger on these. So these fired ones, one would wonder who they were aiming at specifically. And these were the cartridges that they would be using uh, to, to load the rifle. So that's basically it.